Did you know that using electronic devices such as cell phones, tablets, and computers close to bedtime interferes with your body's clock or circadian rhythms? How? Well, the screens on these devices emit something called blue light. The blue light emitted through screens delays the release of melatonin, our sleep-inducing hormone, making it more difficult to fall asleep. This is why it's important to cut back on screen time close to your bedtime. It is best to avoid screens in the hour before bed. If this does not seem manageable, try avoiding screens in the half hour before bed. You could consider this the beginning of your nightly bedtime routine. Electronics disrupt your sleep in more ways than one. Having cell phones and computers close to your bed at night also create other distractions, like fighting the urge to check social media, playing games, and notifications waking you up throughout the night. Do you check your phone before bed? Try reading a book, magazine, or comic as an alternative. Do you charge your phone in your room and use it as an alarm clock? Try plugging it in across the room so that it's not right next to you. Not only does this avoid being woken up by notifications or checking social media when you cannot fall asleep, it forces you to get out of bed in the morning when your alarm goes off. Do text messages, emails, and social media notifications wake you up at times? Put your phone in do not disturb mode. Your alarm will still go off in the morning. However, your phone will not light up or ding at 2 a.m. Finally, there are several applications and built-in features on electronic devices that reduce the amount of blue light that your screen emits if you must use your devices before bedtime. But remember, it is best to just avoid them altogether in the hour leading up to bed.